We can use virtual voice assistants in a variety of ways. First, we can use them to check our pronunciation, and then we can get them to talk back to us so they're engaging with us. And then we can do lots of things. We can make them tell us when we arrive somewhere, we can tell us on a certain date. And so not only are they checking our pronunciation, but they're also interacting with us. I've used them to, with the calendar. So students are reminded at a certain time, vocabulary of a test, for example. Secondly, I've used them for a geographic location. So if we've been studying um, vocabulary of a park or vocabulary of the city, when the student arrives at the location, the reminder will pop up on their phone. And finally, I've used them for all sorts of different enjoyable tasks, taking photos, listening to music, and the voice assistant will do this entirely on its own so the student is interacting and enjoying doing things with the assistant. My favourite virtual voice assistant is Siri and I really enjoy it because I love languages and I love learning languages and nowadays you can speak into your virtual voice assistant, in this case Siri, and you can ask it to translate sentences into Japanese, into Chinese, into French, into German. It's a really enjoyable and really fun way to engage with languages.